go have a, a leaf in my hair. So I came across this place online, it looked crazy, it was like a school bus with a camper van attached to its roof. So I got in touch with the company renting it out, a company called Canopy and Stars. I was like, yo, there's some kind of vehicle wizardry on your website, it can't be real. They're like, yes it is. I was like, no it's not. They're like, yes it is, come check it out. So I've got a van and I've got a friend and I'm gonna go drive up to the Lake District where it's based and check this thing is actually real. So let's go. Ah. <laughs> My knees. Parked up, come to check this place out. Hello. You see it? There it is, no way. <laughs> that looks sick, let's go look. Doesn't that sound like a horror movie? Just a horrible sound. <laughs> Here it is. <laughs> oh, wow. Look at this place. Oh, it's even got its own hot tub. <laughs> That's amazing. This old school bus has travelled all the way from America and it's had this epic refit. There's a compost loo, a hot shower, an arga a sound system and it's actually retained some of its original um, qualities such as the driving door mechanism and the dashboard over there but the most unique thing about this is the fact there's a camper van glued on top of the roof where there's a bedroom which is just unreal so let's go have a look you probably won't do that again because you've got a loop in your hair <laughs> there you go oh, okay <laughs> oh no <laughs> Okay, so as you can see, there's windows all around us here, which is awesome because sunrise or sunset, I'm not really sure which direction is which right now. Um, you can just watch it from your bed, wake up to it, and you're just truly in the middle of nowhere here. I can see a few like houses dotted around in little villages here and there, but you're just amongst nature and just disconnected from everything that's beautiful. This place costs 110 pounds per night. It fits two people, so two of you would stay up here. Um, so Rich is gonna, Rich behind the camera, is gonna stay up here tonight. I'm gonna go sleep in the van. So by the way, here's Rich. Hello He's guys. A, one of the most lovable guys I've ever met in my life. Oh. And look at that smile. Let's <laughs> stop it. So another cool thing about this place is they move the bus uh, here and there so basically one time you could book it and be staying next to a little river like we are here or you could be wake up in the sheep next to you so it adds a little bit of uniqueness to your stays uh, which I think is a really cool thing about this because it is you know slightly mobile obviously they don't drive it on the roads long distances but just moving it around the field to give people a bit of a more unique experience. <laughs> Was that all right? Windy maybe. Yeah. <laughs> also, you have to go check out the Lake District while you're here. There's so many cute little villages and towns around. We went to uh, went to Cockermouth. <laughs> went to Cockermouth. Um, <laughs> Cockermouth. I don't know how to pronounce it. It's definitely Cockermouth. Cockermouth. <laughs> We're near Cockermouth here, so we uh, we went there and went to a few pubs and antique shops, which is cool. But yeah, there's so many amazing trails and villages around the Lake District. Just get out, have a day trip here and there. Go visit some of the amazing lakes and mountains. Um, make the most of your stay here. A sexy bow. Oh, 
his problem going for that, isn't he? Hear the sound. He's like, fuck it, Apple. <laughs> did, you, I don't, did you want the Apple or not? On it. <laughs> what are you doing? So if you want to know more about this place, it's called Hinterlands. So I'll put some info in the description. Um, hope you have a great day. Peace and love. Save the bees. Catch you. I don't know when I'm going to catch you. Bye. <laughs> That's fine. It's just like on the ceiling. <laughs> 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 <laughs>